Hello, my name is Ghulam Abbas and I have been using to-do applications for more than 10 years and I have a good knowledge of all the to-do applications out there. And in this video, I will show you just five top to-do applications which you can just use for your personal and uh, professional use. Okay. So at some point, you need a to-do application where you can just write things there you, uh, because you cannot remember everything in your mind. So this is a chart which I which I made for you to come for the comparison of all the to-do applications out there. The first one is the Google Tasks. The best thing in the Google Task is that because uh, it is very simple and easy to use. If I show you here, if you open your Gmail on the right hand side, there's an option to access your tasks. You can just click here and I write notes here. This is very easy to use and there are some drawbacks because you cannot share task and they don't have the calendar and they don't have the filter tags and you can also not back up your data so next we have is the google keep so i'll show you the google keep so this is very nice application for writing your creative ideas and you can just add the um, list here like this if you can if you click here you can add the list here like this you can also if you click here and write one dot space and then if you write anything press enter it will add the numbers automatically and you can also um, use this um, application from your android and ios application they have the android and ios you can add notes here you can draw your draw anything here and put a save as, as a new note you can you can do so much fun with the google keep at some point you need to use some uh, some better application because you cannot use um, uh, the google keep for bigger projects so i was using the google keep for more than three years and then i have to uh, stop using Google Keep because I, I was not able to manage bigger projects on this Google uh, Keep application. So next we have the, um, uh, so this is the Microsoft To Do. They also have uh, the desktop app. Um, the drawback is that uh, they have a small window for the task details. So, uh, so this is the window where you can just write your task details. This is very small and I don't like this. So if I add a task here, make a new video and then if I press enter, so this task is added. Here I can add more list here, uh, grocery store. Okay, so, so this is the list for the grocery I can add here. Uh, get some milk okay so this works like this so um, also um, there are some drawbacks in the Microsoft to do application as well because they don't have the calendar view which is very important for me they don't have the data backup uh, they have actually but um, the data uh, so the data backup process is very slow if you apply for the data backup they take like three to four days to give your backup data this is a lot of time next we have trello and um, the best part is uh, they have the kanban kanban view um, let me show you here so this is a task um, shopping right so you can open this and add more details in, inside this right and if you are doing this task you can just drag and drop here so this is the kanban board if you drag and drop here this is done so this is a very nice concept they added in in their trello also they have um, so many drawbacks which i don't like because they don't have the calendar they don't have the habit manager they don't have filters smart filters and also they don't have the uh, uh, so they don't have the ability to back up your data so the next is something great this is a tick tick application i really like this application and i use this application i have also um i'm i'm so i'm using their premium version you can just use their free version they have also free version okay so this is the best in category they have web support they have android app ios app desktop application they have calendar they have habit manager they have uh, the ability to share your task with some other we have kanban board we have smart filters 
like uh, you want to filter the tasks which are due for tomorrow and which are important so you so you can filter the task there so they have also tags and the data backup is very fast okay so if i if i click here so i'll show you um get some milk tomorrow so if i press enter so this will automatically add this task for tomorrow because i i i added tomorrow if i go back uh, here in the next 7 days it sh it's, it's, uh, it shows that i need to get some milk tomorrow right so if i if i go back here and i write um meeting with john next week so this will automatically schedule my task for the next week if i if i go back here uh, if i see all my tasks let's let's click here settings go to smart list all tasks show okay click done it will save your settings and here you can see all your tasks it will show me that after 7 days i have meeting with john at 6th april which is wednesday okay so this added the uh, so so it added um like um one week for my meeting also there are so many great options you can track your habits here so let's say you want to make a habit to drink water regularly like 7 uh, to 8, eight glass of water so you can add this habit here and you, and you can track your habit like which days you had a good amount of water also you, there are, you can create unlimited habits here so this is a great application so far so if you are a freelancer or you or you work somewhere or you want to manage your life in a better way you must use some to-do application to manage your life and uh, i've been using the to-do applications for more than 10 years and i strictly i i strongly suggest that you should use the tick tick application because it have all the things which are required for a good application also um if i if i add a new list here a new list and you can also take advantages of the kanban view the kanban view is like this kanban view you can add some here um, like say like um, doing and then done so you can write some task here a task and then you can drag your task here so so it's, so the tick tick application is a one one window application where you can do all these things also here we have a focus option you want to focus for 25 uh, 25 minutes you can just click here and it will show you a timer here on on the top as well uh, so this is a great application so far and i am a big big fan of the tick tick application so this is the end of story um i am using the tick tick application so this is best in category if you have any other app which you like uh, you can just share in comments.